Hey there, Mike Boris of the Mike Boris channel. Today we have a video on how to replace the pre-filter membrane and post-filter of your reverse osmosis water system. And if you're joining us from the previous video on how to repressurize the tank, glad to have you here. If not, you can take a look at that video and it will go over how the repressurization of the tank is completed. So again, glad to have you here. And we are going to refer to the manual that I printed offline. You can get that for free offline. And we are going to go down step by step. Step one, we are going to turn off the ice maker. In our video, we do not have an ice maker, so we are not going to complete that step. We're going to move right to number two. Turn off the water supply to the system. Down below, we have already completed this step. The valve here is in the off position. When it is in line with the actual osmosis and water line, it is open. So you want to make sure you turn it and close it. After closing the valve, step three, turn on the faucet drain. There is a note, may take several minutes, and then you want to turn the faucet off when the tank is empty. In the previous video, we did empty out. The faucet is on. The tank is empty. During the repressurization process, we got all that remaining water that sits on top of the air bladder out of the system. Okay, and then we want to turn off the faucet. Step four, remove the pre-filter, post-filter, and reverse osmosis cartridge by rotating to the left about a third. And as you can see here, the pre-filter is on the left, in the middle is the reverse osmosis, and the post-filter is on the right. And I'm going to come down here and just show you exactly pre-filter, the membrane osmosis cartridge, and then the post filter. And all you're going to do is slowly turn and take each of these out. All three filters are removed. There's a peek at the connection points of the filters. To get to this point, as you can see, the steps are pretty simple. What we're going to do now is continue on to the sanitation process of the entire system. So hop over to the next video. There it is popping up here. And we are going to go over the full in-depth sanitation process of the system.